I'm on the ferry on the way over to the island, and it's, uh, there's a lot of ice, uh, which is pretty awesome. I've never taken this ferry in the winter, done it a lot in summer, spring, autumn, but never winter. And so uh, this is a pretty interesting experience. Pretty cold too. So, uh, the distance from the car to the cabin is about one kilometer. <sighs> Pretty hard work, but luckily it's mostly downhill. So I'll be fine, probably two trips, one kilometer each. And we're at the cemetery. All right, so uh, it's the next morning now and I arrived yesterday, as you saw. Last night I had a great time just relaxing in front of the fire, eating dinner. Now I'm on my way out to do one more trip to the car to pick up the rest of the water. The reason I'm here at the cabin is to write another ebook. I've uh, written a few books in the past uh, for the Sweet Natural Living community and I thought it was about time that I wrote a book about running. for a run just got ready uh, it's a fine fine day look at it the sun is out still ice on the on the ocean fjord or whatever but um, spring is on the horizon for sure So, got this one and the gimbal. Ooh. All right, so we have our gimbal set up with the GoPro. And um, pretty cool, it's got a selfie button. So if I just click this button, it comes around into selfie mode. So that's awesome. And we're gonna see if we can do some filming with two cameras today, just to capture more angles and I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Never learned how to crawl, but I learned how to walk and I told myself how to run. Been moving so fast now, running the past, can only do that for so long. But I still got the fire, I'm a midnight fly with this one thing that I know. I didn't do this on my own. I didn't do this on my own. So this is where the, the ferry comes in. We're on an island after all. 
mainland is, is over there and yeah this is uh, one of the sunniest spots on the on the whole island that's ice floating around very nice very nice spot it's a it's a very small island from the cabin to the ferry it's about two and a half kilometers this island used to be an old uh, mining island where they mined for iron so this island is actually known for its uh, iron mines and they're all over the place. It's not my favorite place to run because it's very hilly. And right now, of course, it's very kind of difficult with the ice and snow some places. For the last two summers, I've been uh, doing like a time trial here. I'll put a link to the video up in the corner uh, where I basically go not all out, but like a tempo type of effort, a little bit harder than that. And I just, uh, I get a good idea of where I stand in terms of my fitness. So I'll probably be doing that again in a few months. So always a fun event. And if you want to see the whole route, I also have a, a GoPro video with the gimbal where I filmed the whole thing. Back at the cabin. Beautiful. And it's melting quickly, the ice. Definitely melting quickly, day by day. Sun is up there. It probably comes up over there, goes up like this. This is the highest point. Comes back down. So we don't actually get any sun in this location at this time. In the summer, the sun comes up over there, it goes like this, up, 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 and then it, it sort of goes over the whole, around the whole place and sets over there before it comes back up again, right? Long days in the summer in Norway. Okay, time to chop some wood and then do some uh, strength training. So the wood here is pretty wet. It's been under here for a few years and moisture builds up. So it's a little bit challenging, but I'm trying to look for, for the ones that are, uh, are the driest and, and chop them into more manageable pieces to get the fire started. Even some small kindling, is that what they say? The, you know, the smallest ones. And also get some ready for my mom She's coming down here when, when I'm leaving. So I really enjoy chopping wood. It's just a very satisfying process. Just chop, chop. <laughs> uh, physical work, uh, simple, um, natural. I love wood. So yeah, really enjoying myself right now. So I'm working on a new ebook and uh free it's 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 hard work i i wouldn't say that i love writing ebooks i've written a few ebooks in the past uh about bananas i've written about uh traveling i've written about sleep and um there's you know links in the description to to those books but i thought i felt like it was about time that i wrote a book about running i find that when i'm at home there's too many distractions i'm too in my normal life you know there's uh, and i have all my other obligations so basically what i've done is that i i've just wiped most of my obligations for the whole week and i'm just headed down here and i'm just every day writing 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 running 
writing, 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 resting and sleeping, writing again next day. So mostly just writing, uh, running and relaxing. And I only have that much writing power in any given day anyway. I get my first session for the day, I'm very creative. Everything flows for at least two hours, maybe three. Then I, I'm just like, whoa, you know, my brain is fried and I have to get out and I go out for a run, etc. I come home, eat lunch. And then I do my second session for the day. And so, yeah, I try to maintain the quality and just quickly <laughs> grind out uh, an ebook uh, in, a, in about a week. Um, so that will be the bulk of the writing. I'll do the bulk of the writing here. Then when I get home over the next few weeks, I'll uh, edit it, um, I'll put in the pictures, I will sort of get the, the book ready and, and prepare the landing page, etc. And then I'll launch it for you guys. So definitely stay tuned for my ebook. And of course, if you're watching this vlog in like a year, uh, the ebook is going to be um, linked in the description probably. All right, that's it. That's it for this time. I'm heading uh, home. Beautiful weather. watching if you like this vlog give it a like please subscribe and stay tuned for more videos thanks for watching